Composing a Life, by Mary Catherine Bateson is a thought-provoking exploration of the complexities and fluidity of women's lives. Bateson employs a unique blend of personal narrative, academic insight, and philosophical reflection to delve into the ways in which women construct and navigate their life trajectories. The central premise of the book revolves around the concept of life as an ongoing composition, a work of art in progress. Bateson draws inspiration from music, describing life as a piece that is constantly evolving, shaped by the interplay of various themes and experiences. This metaphorical framework allows her to convey the dynamic and improvisational nature of women's lives, emphasizing the importance of embracing change and uncertainty. One of the key strengths of Bateson's work lies in her ability to seamlessly weave together diverse narratives and perspectives. Through a series of case studies and interviews with women from different backgrounds, she presents a rich tapestry of experiences that challenge traditional notions of linear and predictable life paths. This approach not only adds depth to her analysis but also underscores the diversity of ways in which women engage with the process of composing their lives. Bateson also introduces the concept of the sequence, emphasizing the interconnectedness of various life stages and experiences. She argues against viewing life as a series of isolated events or fixed stages, advocating instead for an understanding of life as a continuous and overlapping series of compositions. This perspective allows for a more nuanced understanding of women's lives, acknowledging the simultaneous presence of multiple roles and identities. Throughout the book, Bateson emphasizes the importance of resilience and adaptability in the face of life's uncertainties. She challenges the notion of a predetermined life script, encouraging women to embrace the creative potential of unexpected turns and detours. In doing so, Bateson advocates for a more open-ended and flexible approach to life, one that values the process of adaptation and growth over rigid adherence to predefined goals. The intersection of personal and cultural influences is another theme that permeates Bateson's analysis. She explores how societal expectations and cultural norms shape women's choices and opportunities, often constraining the possibilities available to them. By acknowledging these external forces, Bateson encourages readers to critically examine the societal structures that influence their lives and to actively participate in the ongoing composition of their narratives. Bateson's writing style is both engaging and reflective, inviting readers to contemplate their own lives within the framework she presents. Her prose is imbued with a sense of curiosity and empathy, fostering a connection between the reader and the diverse women whose stories are interwoven throughout the book. This empathetic approach contributes to the accessibility of her work, making complex theoretical concepts relatable and applicable to a broad audience. In conclusion, Composing a Life is a compelling exploration of the intricate and ever-evolving nature of women's lives. Mary Catherine Bateson's use of metaphor, case studies, and interdisciplinary perspectives creates a multifaceted portrait of the ways in which women navigate the complexities of existence. By challenging conventional narratives and advocating for a more fluid and creative approach to life, Bateson offers a valuable contribution to the ongoing discourse on identity, resilience, and the art of living.